Hey everybody, it's Crappie Dan. A little tip about helping make your rod more functional in all weather. Um, this particular rod has a, a bare blank and then it's got cork and then it's got cork. Great, great for when you're uh, casting and using the rod. However, there are times where you want to put it into a rod holder and you don't want that bare graphite getting inside your rod holder that'll break that down. So we're going to use these for pulling. So uh, to make them more functional, what I've done is I've taken shrink wrap and you can buy this on Amazon. It'll come in packs just like this. They're called Mako Grips. This is one brand or other brands. Uh, and you can see it comes in bulk and you can cut it to length of whatever the length is for your area that you want to cover on your rods. And what happens is this shrinks under heat. So in order to get the rod covered and have it tight like this is, you can just take a heat gun like this heat gun, or you can take a hair dryer and put it on high and you can just keep it on this and let it shrink down. But when you do that, Start at one end and work it down so the air comes out of that as this shrinks down onto this rod. This you can't twist. It's really good for gripping. You can do it when it's wet. It won't come off. It's going to stay on here and it's going to protect that rod and it will help it to last forever and make it functional with use with your hands. So something very inexpensive. You can heat this on there. Put it, you could put it halfway, you could only put it in here if you wanted to, keep the cork. I like it because it isn't going to slip out of my hand when I'm using it on the water or in the rain or in the cold. And it'll work on any rod that you want to use. In this particular case, I'm just putting them on our trolling rods. Little tip, inexpensive, go get yours off of Amazon, put it on your favorite rod to protect it and use it and keep it usable throughout your life. Crappie Dan, till next time, catch a lot of crappie.